All right, Vaughn. We're, we're back. <laughs> we're back. <laughs> I think you got to do it every week. <laughs> every week. I sound a little different for some reason. Do you? I don't know. Maybe it's just my uh, sinuses. I don't. I don't think you sound any different than normal. <laughs> yeah, I know. Uh, guess we can. So, hey, this is the reveal episode. Like, so we've been planning for this week to have our uh, the DNA reveal yes. test done. Mm-hmm. And the person that was going to read said reveal. Uh, we were we were hoping we would get it in time. Yeah. And I mean, no lie. Five minutes before we started this episode, we got it in. We were sweating our chromosomes out. <laughs> we were. <laughs> we were, man. So uh, luckily we got it in. So this can be a good episode. Uh, and, you know, we can't have to make anything up or, you know, yeah. or postpone, postpone the reveal. I know people are waiting on the edge of their seats to know if we're brothers or not. I think you're going to be my sister. I'm pretty sure we are. With that new haircut you got. Dude, this is my, uh, <clears throat> this is the original Dale haircut. Yeah, it looks, it looks great. It's a lot of volume. I, it is a lot of volume. You have a very volu- voluminous, 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 voluminous. That too. It's a good word. You got all of them. Yep. <clears throat> Excuse me. So, uh, what's been going on this week, man? Anything good for you? Man, just killing it work, doing a you know, doing my normal my normal life job. You wanna get an update on the podcast studio? Oh yeah. So um podcast studio is in the final stages. We are having the air conditioning installed tomorrow. Um I've done part of it. I'm gonna have the electricians come tomorrow. It's looking good. Um, I'm excited. Been, I haven't I, seen it yet. I knocked a, a full <clears throat> brick out of my own home on accident, but you don't need it. Quite honestly, that I, there's a, so many more bricks that I think the house will be just fine. <laughs> it's not a load bearing brick. No, I don't think okay, so. And if it was, we got a problem. Yeah, uh, I'm excited. So this is potentially our last week here at uh, the Not Studio of your mother in laws. This is the last week, here. but. <clears throat> It's been nice having her. She's super gracious. She is, and it's fun to pick on her. Oh, while, she's, we're, while we're waiting to finish, she's great. She just, she just. <laughs> a few minutes ago, I didn't tell anybody because there's only like two left, and I'm, you know, extremely selfish. She has a snickerdoodle, pumpkin spiced, like muffins. Yeah, oh, they're phenomenal. Yeah, I didn't get any. I appreciate it. No, I'll have her get you some next week. Yeah, I'm all low carb, so we're good. Oh, these are uh, can't these, do it. These are zero carbs. Oh, okay, we're we're good. They're from the they're from the keto store. <laughs> yeah, so well, that's good, man. I'm excited about the uh, I'm excited about the the podcast studio. We'll have like an actual spot. From there, we have some plans. Uh, I think our first guest we've talked about is having a uh, is Adam uh, Adam on the set. Audio Jesus. Audio Jesus. He's uh, yeah. So I figured we'll have Adam there for our first one live in the new studio. That's the plan. Hope that works out. I'll have to get with my people to get with his people. You know, he's a, yeah. he's a busy guy. Yeah. That means I just got to talk to Daniel. Yeah. That's all it is. <laughs> Give him sign the permission slip. His agent. Yeah. <laughs> uh, so, but I think that'll be a good time to get him on. And then, uh, like I said, man, I, I just think we have some good stuff in the works. And, uh, oh, so you were out of town this week. <clears throat> And I, uh, I got to sit down and meet with uh, Jaku, Yaku. Mm-hmm. Is mm-hmm. how you say his name? And he's from, you know, the owner of Bison. Yeah. And so uh, we've talked online, but I haven't got to meet him yet. You know, Jason's told me a lot about him, so I actually sat down with Jason, who does all of our visual and audio, our visual and production of the show uh, with Media by Bison. Sat down with him, Frank, who's uh, Yaku's twenty-one-year-old son, who's a trip, but he's also like a I think he does a lot of media stuff with Jason. These guys are great. Uh, and then Yaku, we met, we sat down and uh, had a beer at Craft 96. And uh, man, I tell you what, he's a cool dude. Yaku's freaking, he's intense, man. Like he's, he's wild. Like I could see it. He's from South Africa. And like the cool thing, he was telling me a story about how, uh, you know, coming to America, I think they've been here like 12, 13 years. 
and uh you know him talking about being a being a patriot and being a he love in America. Uh it's just cool to hear people from, come from other countries that yeah taking full advantage of what America can do for you. Absolutely. And so hearing that it makes you more proud to be an American which it's it's just cool uh, uh, the, the guy and what he's kind of came from what the businesses he built. Uh, he's got a business called Protecto Burn which is which is industrial like a fire extinguishing system unit with this foam. Uh, it was pretty neat. And then he's got some other stuff in the works. He's been talking about the other day. So this guy, he's got a lot going on, uh, a lot bigger stuff than we're, we're privy to. Yeah. Uh, you know, we're just drinking his energy drinks and right. enjoy them. Yeah. <laughs> but he's got, a, he got a lot going on, but this guy is super intense. And like, he was like a, I don't know what kind of armed forces he was over there. And Stu's a helicopter pilot. And, uh, you, Jason showed us those videos of his helicopter piloting. Yeah, man, he's got this dude's got a McLaren. His son drives like a eighty mile an hour go kart around the neighborhood. Apparently, I talked about <laughs> that. So these guys are nuts. So, uh, but talking about that, you know, he's like he he really lives the badass bison like mantra. Like that's, you know, he, that's what he's all about. And yeah. so we kind of talked about like doing like a weekly, like a badass bison moment of the week in, um, which involves me and you, which is funny because I'm not, a I, and I'm not a badass. <laughs> You're not a badass. All <laughs> the things, all the things that I don't want to do are going to be happening to me on a weekly basis. So for me, I like to do crazy stuff and I like, I, I'm not like, the way I grew up with my buddies, like, dude, we like pain. Like, we would do, like, the jackass kind of stuff, and, yeah. like, I enjoyed that. So it kind of excites me. It makes me more happy because how how much nervous, like, how nervous you are. How many more brain cells I have. Yeah, well, that too. I'm not the smartest <laughs> cat. I just, I'm a, you know, my buddy Jacob, he, he laughs, uh, like, you know, I have a saying that I, I said one time, like, like, don't don't think, just do. And that's just me, man. I don't think yeah. about much. I just uh, I'm a, uh, a doer. Yeah. yeah. You know, here at, I'm a big, big dumb animal. Here at 38 years old, I'm getting into a situation where I now have to be forced into being a badass for, yeah. for a podcast. Dude. It's, you know, it's, it's, but once you meet Yaku, you're going to realize, okay, you're still not going to do it, but right. at least it'll make me, I'm, I feel even more happy that you're scared to do a lot of things. I mean, if it's, if it's like daredevil stuff, I'm good with that. It's like, you know, eating earthworms. I, I'm not gonna. No, do that. I'm well, not gonna do that. I'm not touching snakes either, Yaku. And I'm so. not gonna touch snakes. No. Or so. roaches. Well, I don't mind roaches. That's disgusting. I grew up in a trailer, so I don't know about roaches. Dude. I said that one time on the TV show. My mom got mad about. It. You just said it again. Now she can get <laughs> mad again. I know, but it's not that my house was dirty. We lived in the, near the woods, you know. So, uh, but you like couldn't the, see the wheel. You couldn't see the wheels on your trailer. <laughs> no, you can't. They were exposed. <laughs> <laughs> we were ready to roll anytime. They had rims on them. Yeah, we had spinners. <laughs> we had a classy one. Oh, uh, hey, man, that's how I grew up. Wouldn't have it any other way. But so, but talking with Yaku, and uh, we were like, man, let's let's think of some stuff. What can we do? I mean, I'm going to lean on Jason and Yaku, which is probably I probably shouldn't do. Like, they're he's probably the best voice of reasoning because this guy's. It's stuff that we're doing. It's not like he's doing it with us. I mean, eventually we'll, we need to, like, Yaku, I think we're going to get him in studio when we get the new podcast, uh, studio yeah. ready. Yeah. We talked about him having on, cause man, one, he's got a cool story. We can talk about him. And, uh, I mean, I think we'll do some crazy stuff with this guy. I, I, I'll make y'all arm, arm wrestle with your shirts off or something. And then, uh, what is the difference between arm wrestling with your shirt off? And I don't know. It's just more on. badass with your shirt off. That is true. So I'll do over the top. But we're going to do something, uh, so Jason brought something today and we're probably not going to do it on the podcast on here, but we're going to do it because I think this, this is more of a visual thing to be on our YouTube channel. Uh, but I have something here that we're going to do that I know you're going to be scared of. It's not earthworms. Great. But it is involved in eating something. See, and then if we start with eating something, uh, of you all the things, <laughs> I will get in airplanes. I'll do, I'll do anything crazy daredevilish, but nope, when it nice. comes to Eating Note stuff. It, Jason. I will do any daredevil thing, except for heights. I'm not really good at heights. Well, that's you just said airplane. You, you don't okay, have airplanes. All the, you're, you're, you want them to taxi you're, around. You're, you're like you're in a in a fuselage. You're you're what is it? You're in cap encapsulated. Okay. Well, I'll tell Yaku you said that, and we'll be fine. And with I'm that. not jumping off any cliffs. You know what? Screw it. I'm gonna do whatever <laughs> I have to do 
For the content, baby. The content. <laughs> content. Okay. <laughs> well, hey, first, we're going to do this. Oh, great. The pack, I guess it's called packy. The one chip challenge. Uh, I mean, I'm going to regret this too. I'll be in the bathroom all day. Oh, here we go. You ever done, you eat spicy stuff? I, so I know I do eat spicy stuff, but that is beyond spicy. That is legitimately pure capsaicin e- extract. What does that mean? So uh, essentially, if you take a regular jalapeno pepper, it goes by a Scoville unit. Measure. Yeah. A regular jalapeno pepper is 5,000 Scovilles. How many is that? It doesn't say. It just says uh, there's a lot of – there's a big warning label on the back. We don't need to read that. No, you got heart condition or pregnant? I do now. I am now. Okay. Well, you're still good. It says you're fine. I'm going to come out with a spicy One baby. One challenge, Carolina Reaper, Scorpion plus Scorpion Pepper. Oh, great. This chip will destroy you. <laughs> <laughs> Uh, I mean, I've never done this. I've seen people do it like on TikTok, and uh, I've never ate real something like this. I want to see how many Scovilles that thing is. Yeah, just find out. But we're going to do this. Uh, this will be up on the YouTube channel. So the Packy One Chip Challenge will be our this week's uh, like badass bison moment of the week. So should be fun. I'm excited for. I'll do anything just to where I can see Vaughn sweat it. And, uh, oh, I'm definitely going to sweat. <laughs> it's probably a terrible idea. It, no, it is. We we're, we're probably need to do this once. For, I don't know, man. This is not good. It, it, it's, got, I, it's got four grams of carbs. Maybe we shouldn't do it. What I'm, what I'm your pulling up. What I'm pulling up here. You don't eat the whole chip. I mean, I'm not eating the whole chip. I don't want to kill myself. What I'm pulling up here is only showing 21,000. That's not That's not even bad. bad that dude. can't be accurate. No, but that's not accurate. How do you know? Because 21,000 The internet is, don't lie. No. No, the internet does lie. Not on not about the one chip challenge. Let's say it's like, it's like four and a half times hotter than a regular jalapeno pepper. Oh, that's good. It's I, okay. my limit's 5, 5 times 5 times hotter. Okay. Then we'll dude, see. I think this is going to be good. So, this will be our uh we need to get some salsa to go with it. I need to talk to Jason. We need to have like a cool, like a, a visual intro showing the uh, badass bison moment of the week. I think it'd be cool. I'm down. I mean, he's got. I said it, so he's got to do it now. So they're the they're the media pros, not us. We just tell him we want something, and then he's got to figure it out. <laughs> That's how we roll. He's shaking his head back there. So yeah, we're good. At the detriment of our health. Yeah, Jason don't care. We're going to make him take a bite, too. Just so he, his insides can be torn up, too. 21,000 skull units is not bad. I was expecting worse. I, I, I feel like that that's not accurate. So, we'll, find out. well, that's what we're doing today. Uh, this will be on our, like, you need to make sure to go subscribe and watch the YouTube so you can see this once this comes out. And we'll, uh, I'm sure we'll give Jason, we'll maybe... Take a little clip of it, make a uh, Instagram reel or something for TikTok. We we got to start doing those. I know we we've talked about it, so we can start putting some more content out there. We're just trying to go viral, guys. That's all it is. Just going viral. <laughs> we need we need followers. Oh, well, viral Vaughn. Viral Vaughn. So, uh, is that your nickname? New nickname? I mean, okay, we'll roll with it with Uncle Dale and Viral Vaughn, <laughs> <laughs> or venereal Vaughn. <laughs> I hope not. <laughs> so, uh, yeah. So good thing is we have the, um, we have the results of our DNA test. We do. So we're going to watch that. We'll watch it live, like a live reaction. And then we'll, I'll just like have the mic up to uh, the, the speaker up to my mic so we can have the audio. And then we'll put that video clip up on YouTube as well. And so, uh, I think we'll take a quick break. So we can get that started, and then we'll come back with the uh, – we'll play the reveal. Dude. Everybody's waiting to hear. I know. That we're sisters. I know. Daniela and Vonetta. <laughs> <laughs> no, it's Daylene. Daylene. Yeah. Daylene and Vonell. Vonell. So, uh, <laughs> yeah. Well, so let's take a quick break, and uh, we'll come back with the results from our uh, – 
Mouth swabs. Making a murder. Part yep. two. Oh, God. <laughs> Rude. You know, I've always wanted to be a badass. Uh, you're definitely not. <laughs> but, well, you know, I've been a, somewhat of a badass. And then more so, I've been drinking these Bison Energy drinks. Yeah. And uh, their slogan is, let's face it, you're a badass. Take a sip of this. Like, and that's all it takes? Instant badass. Is that it's guaranteed? Try it. All right, dude. I'm try it. So the cool thing about these guys, they are a local based uh, League City company, and uh, they got great products. I mean, let alone they have energy drinks that turn into a badass. They also have beard bombs, which will go good with your freshly shaved face. So you need to grow a beard. Is my voice deeper now? It's def- you sound more badass. Because I'm a badass. Yeah, pretty much. God. I haven't drank enough yet. Oh, <laughs> but uh, yeah, man. So you need to check these guys out. Bison Energy. Uh, they have energy drinks. You have the regular. I have the sugar free. They have uh, tattoo salves. They have beard bombs, beard oils. Uh, so you go check them out at bisonproducts.com and use the code Dale Not Dale. Gives you a discount at checkout. Uh, and it also helps put money in our pockets. Let's just kind of, let's face it. Absolutely. It's going to help us out. Now, after having that, I'm going to need that beard stuff because I'm going to grow one. Yeah. So if you want to be a badass, drink Bison Energy. All right, Vaughn. So we are now to the time for the uh, reveal. Oh, man. So we haven't watched it yet. So this is going to be our uh, live reaction to it. I mean, we know who's doing it because yeah. we were part of picking the person. But we didn't uh, – we don't know how it's going to come out. Like, you know, we kind of gave them we – gave, we gave them direction on where to go with it. Yeah. But – uh how and what he does with it because he's a professional we'll find that out here he's a professional dna reader <laughs> yes so dude, honestly, he's dude he's 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 got things going on i think he's the real dr phil i mean as a kid i guess that's probably high school years i mean i watched his show i'm assuming it's still on i don't know it should be you made a video for us, so we're going to play this for you guys. We're going to play it on here, and then we'll have it up on uh, – It'll be on, you'll be able to see the visual on the YouTube channel for this episode. And then I'm thinking we maybe uh, – it's another thing I'm going to try to get Jason to do. Maybe we can have – we can make some kind of video from the – from me and you when we did the swabs. Yeah. Like maybe do a little cut video, Jason, like – like a little clip of us doing that, re- going into this video of the guy talking, just have for like a real, like kind of like a, or the YouTube shorts, something like that. It'll be just kind of like he, he can make like that, make that one little, one little clip of it all together. Yeah, that'd be cool. Something kind of short to where it just, uh, and then having our guy read the stuff. So I swab you. you can you see if I, if I do like this? Can you see? Yeah, I can. Okay. I see. <laughs> uh, Jerry. So, yeah, who 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 who's doing it? So the people on the podcast listening will know. Ladies and gentlemen, Jerry Springer. Jerry Springer <laughs> is reading our DNA <laughs> results. <laughs> we, oh, hey, man. we were like, okay, there's a couple guys. Maury, uh, I was I couldn't find Maury. Couldn't find him. So he's it's his problem. Uh, I was like, next best person. And what I really watched was Jerry Springer. Yeah. So this is more, uh, this is our age group too. I mean, this is like, he was during our span of growing up, he was the height. I mean, he was the best. He's he's taught me a lot about life and yeah. And I've kind of rolled with it. Yeah. Yeah. Taught me me not to punch my parents. Don't punch your parents. You can't do it. Yeah. You can't do, uh, I don't know, man. No, and nobody should make fun of you. Fun of you if you want to be a woman. His show was wild. Yeah. <laughs> His show was wild. So uh we we're gonna play the reveal right now. So I'm a, you can see it. I guess it doesn't matter if we see it. I mean it's just him, but I'm gonna I'm gonna hold it up so we can Hey guys, Jerry Springer here, and I've been brought in by Dale and Vaughn to be an intermediary to the craziness that's about to happen. You see, uh the results are in. And uh, these uh, good-looking, witty, boisterous guys, uh, well, the question, of course, is, are, are they brothers? Are they twin brothers? 
Most people seem to think they are. Well, with a DNA accuracy of a 99.7%, uh, the lab results are now in, and as I'm looking at them here, uh, I can say with certainty that uh, the results are inconclusive. Uh -uh. They're, they're inconclusive. Uh, looks like we're going to need a stool sample. <laughs> There's no way to know. There's no way to know. I do know this, in fairness. I do know this, that Dale and Vaughn are both guys of good character. And you might both say to me, well, wait a second, how do I know they're of good character? I'll tell you how I know. I checked out records. And as I look at them here, um, let me see. Uh, yep, neither Dale or Vaughn have ever been on my show. And that, of course, is a sign of good character. You don't ever want to have been on the show, man. That would have been awful. So good for you guys. Uh, I hope uh, the rest of the year turns out to be really good for you. And uh, I wish you only the very best of luck. Remember to take care of yourselves and each other. Oh, that is awesome. Jerry, 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 Jerry. I, <laughs> Dude. Inconclusive. What does that mean? That means we're sisters. There's no conclusion. Okay. It means they couldn't figure out if we're brothers or not. So he said we need to send in a stool sample. Uh, yeah. How's that going to work? I don't know. Maybe we'll get this little thing they do in, in animals. Like, like a prodder? Yeah. Like a butt prodder? Oh, God. <laughs> <laughs> Dude, that was awesome. Uh, I cannot believe we had... You know, that Jerry. is... Not, not many podcasts in the world bring on Jerry. Hey, we got Jerry, guys. We did. He's in our hip pocket. He is. So anything we, I mean, uh, anything else we need read live or results, he's doing it. And he emailed us and he asked if we wanted to go to dinner and hang out sometime. Yeah, I mean, I'm down. I am too. Uh, and man, that was awesome. And and us not being on his show, quite honestly, he thinks that's a good thing. I don't. I, I wonder if he, if he. I mean, I guess they have a database. I'm thinking I haven't been on that show, but who may have been? <laughs> I used to get wild back in the day. You don't remember. I don't remember. You just don't remember. A lot of things I blocked out of my life. <laughs> Golly. Uh, no, that was, dude, that was awesome. That was, that was awesome. more than I, like, you know, we had an idea because, uh, you know, we sent him the request and he obliged. And so we will have this on the YouTube channel so you can see it. But man, that's funny. I, I just can't believe that, uh, it's funny that Jerry Springer did. I think that was a good, a good touch to the uh, Jerry Springer, man. I, I I just can't believe it's inconclusive. What are we gonna do now? We're now we're on to a stool sample. Yeah, that should be fun. Uh, do you, you want to do the stool sample after we eat uh, packy chip? <laughs> Dude, oh yeah, let's do that. <laughs> let's do that. Your stool has thirty-seven thousand Sculpa units. <laughs> This is one hot stool. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> oh, man. Come on down to the lab and get yourself a steamy stool. Oh, Jesus. <laughs> this episode took a turn for the worse. It did. It did. <laughs> so, well, like I said, we wanted you guys to hear the uh, the live results. It was live for us, too. So that was, that was cool, man. He did more with it than we even thought. Yeah. We just asked him to read the, read the yeah. results. He called us boisterous boys. Boisterous boys. I know what boisterous boys. means. Does that mean like you got big boobs? Yeah. Okay. Yes. That's exactly what that means. Boisterous bosoms. Uh, <laughs> dude, Jerry Springer, of all people. Of all people. You know, he actually looks pretty good. I don't think that people, uh, I know we kind of said that everybody would know. Well, everybody knows Jerry Springer, but I, I don't know if people even out there listening knew that we were going to get Jerry Springer to do it. So No. I mean, because no, nobody would think something like that. Yeah, so I'm gonna have, I'm gonna put this clip up. Uh, I'll work with Jason. We'll put some kind of clip up on the Instagram, and I'll share that on there and on mine, on my personal. Uh, and so that you guys can see the uh, the results read from him. And uh, that is so awesome. <laughs> hearing Jerry Springer say "stool sample" is funny, yeah. but I mean, I, I know he said I mean, they talk about worse on their show. I get oh it. yeah, but it's just funny. I mean, stool is just a funny word when you're stool is even at 39 word. years old. It's funny. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know what it is. Like it doesn't get old. It uh, doesn't get old. So, and when it does, it turns white. Well, that's good. So, <laughs> uh, well, it's been a fun episode, man. We wanted to come on here. This was mainly, this is a kind of a short one just so we could have the reveal. Yeah. Uh, our first week of doing the 
badass bison moment of the week. No, oh, and yeah. so well, I'm sure we'll, we'll we'll have a maybe we'll have a little teaser on the podcast of us doing this uh, audio. I mean, this is definitely more of a visual thing that'll be on YouTube, right? So make sure you go subscribe to that, and you will see uh, the hilarity and uh, whatever may ensue from me eating the packy chip. Uh, I can't wait. Yeah, so this should be fun. So uh, until the end, we'll we'll get off here. Uh, I can't wait for you guys to listen to this episode. Check it out, and then uh, next week we have an exciting new guest on. We do. We're going to be recording with uh, Aunt Kiki. So get ready. We got we got plans for Aunt Kiki. I, I cannot begin to tell you how excited I Dude. am about this. Kiki, like, all my buddies love to mess with Kiki just because, she's, you know, she's just a trip. And uh, Vaughn really has got some good <laughs> stuff that he does with her. Like, she does a lot of Instagram and, like, promotion stuff. And Vaughn's always messing with her about that. So oh, next man. episode with her. We got to talk about it. Next we'll talk episode. about that, and then we've got. I've got some videos of Vaughn doing stuff, acting like Crystal. That'll be uh, discussed yeah. and released uh, yeah. past this. They got to be edited. Yeah, <laughs> <laughs> yeah. <laughs> so, but uh, but like I said, man, uh, this was a this was a fun little episode. We want you guys to hear the results. Uh, we're glad we got Springer on to do it. Uh, I think that's a nice touch. Yes. It really, it really ate into our uh, podcast production budget, but it did. It's all good. It really did. But the good thing is, is uh, it's all for content. We're 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 going to be friends with him now, and maybe he'll give us a break. Yeah, no kidding. So, uh, but we'll see y'all, and uh, you'll hear from us next week, and we'll have Aunt Kiki on, and we'll do some social media stuff with her as well, so where we can kind of hype that up. But uh, yeah. So inconclusive, man. We're not. We don't know yet. We we got to find out. We got to find out. Everybody's going to want to know. Yeah, we got to just get those stool samples done. We should do, uh, we should, yeah, we should do that. All right. Well, good deal, man. We'll, uh, we'll catch y'all on the next one. All righty. See y'all later.